everybody. Welcome back to another guide video. Today we're doing cutthroat trout and cutthroat trout are some of my favorites. The first dive and cutthroat trout that I caught, I actually held the community record for the largest cutthroat caught for a little while. It has since been broken, but I was pretty proud of that. I'm in the record books for a little while. I'm pretty proud of that. But anyway, diamond cutty, 13.87 pounds. Shallow pond, deep pond, lake shore, egg spoon, spinner, top bait preferences. We'll expand that for a second. Uh, worm, blood worm, red worm, grub, shad, tube. I think, I, I can't remember if it was a spoon or a spinner. I got mine off a spoon or a spinner. Um, and I think I was using, oh, it wasn't very big. It was a five or a six. I was using a five or a six, I believe. It wasn't super big. I was also getting silvers on that. Um, I know for golds, you want a size like four, um, and then a size three or two, I think, is diamond. I can't remember if you're going to get golds on threes or not. Um, I feel like I've had people tell me they've got golds on a size three, and then some people say they can only, they've only gotten a diamond on size three, so the word, so the kind of, the definitive answer is still, uh, still up for debate on that one. Um, as far as I'm aware, I know in the community resources of the community guide, they say two, a size two is diamond and above. Um, and then you can get golds on three. So I haven't tested it myself, but you know, that way, you know, at least a four or a three is going to get you, you know, probably the bigger, the bigger cutthroat trout. And they are pretty big fish, 13.87 pounds. It kind of makes sense, you know, with looking at the other fish and their hook sizes and everything. So take that with a grain of salt but that's going to point you in the right direction it may not be the definitive answer but it's going to get you in the right direction and that's the point of these videos just pointing you in the right direction getting you started here so as far as the traits go easily spooked hard fighter jumper last stand sun lover um and i will say sun lover i definitely get the most trout Especially cutthroats and brookies from like 6 a.m. to noon. Seemingly always. So that's a great time to fish for these. But that's what you're going to use for the cutthroat trout. We'll go to the map. I caught my diamond right here where this guy's fishing. I also caught my diamond kokanee here. So you're going to get both kokanee and cutthroat. Cutthroat? Cutthroat. Between the Roaring Devil Outpost and the bridge. Fish kite all up and down here. You'll get a little bit of both. And then this is another spot I've seen diamond cutthroats being pulled out of. Um, there are some other spots people have been talking about, but I haven't seen that personally. So um, I know people, this is my diamond brookie spot down here. People say that they've got um, diamond cutthroats from here. I've not seen that in game um, and in, not from anybody that I'm like super close to or would trust emphatically. So but it is on the resource hub. It is a barked uh, diamond spot there. So you could try it out for sure. Again, the resource like hub is a channel in the angler official discord and there's spreadsheets in there. And there's a community, uh, community created guide where everybody kind of contributes to it. So I do trust them, uh, with a lot of pretty much really a lot of stuff, but I just haven't seen it. So, um, I don't know a hundred percent how much of a hotspot it is. But I know this one and this one deliver pretty regularly. So check those out. Um, that's pretty much all I have on the cutthroat trout. If you have any questions, uh, leave it in the comments. If this was helpful, leave a like. If you want to see more guides, consider subscribing. Otherwise, uh, I'll see you in the next one. No, wait. I'll catch you in the next one. God, I, I've been doing... Why do I keep... I'll catch you in the next one. Thanks, guys. Man, amateur hour over here, huh?